one of the things that I love about playing Thomas Tina is that um, she seems <coughs> to not be insane at all. In fact, what's so wonderful about her is that she's uh, in love with the arts and in love with nature. And um, one of the things that Eric Hosard is the director, one of the things that he talked to me about was how yeah, I'm, I'm very much a tomboy, and I, I wanted to bring that into the role. And I thought, well, I don't know, does that fit the period? Does that fit with that little girl, how she would behave? And he said, you know, we we separate now. We separate the idea that, you know, when you're in high school, you're either a jock or you're, you know, a, a nerd or you're all these things. You're If you're physical, then you're, you're really physical, but you're a little stupid. And if you're really, really smart, you're not that physical, right? We sort of divide people into these stereotypes. And he said, I think in that time period, especially, and going back even further, um, you know, mathematics and knowledge was very much connected to nature and, 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 and being connected to life and being a physical person. And I loved that idea. So I, I loved, and, and you know, Thomasina is, is, you know, she's in love with the romantic idea and with Lord Byron and she's in love with, you know, she thinks that the, uh, the this Mr. Noakes uh, landscape idea, this whole idea of this romantic landscape and, and uh, these ruins and I, I just think that she's in love with love and romance and, and, and she's not just sort of this person who sits here like this and it's just has this big brain. Um, and so this character is a combination of all of these things. And I think there's an argument to be made in the play about that, that uh, there's two characters that, um, and we'll, we'll get into this a little bit, that, that live these sort of this one track mind, they believe this thing and they, they're not a fan of the other. And I think Thomasina holds both in her hand, which is why she's capable of coming up with such amazing ideas. Is that she's not one or the other, but she embraces all of it. And I wish as a child I grew up that way. Not thinking that math was something that I didn't do because I was more into the arts. I wish that I'd, I'd read this play when I was a child and realized that the arts can illuminate the math and vice versa. So. I think, I think it's a shame that we do were raised that way to think that it is one or the other. Subconsciously, consciously, and that this character is not. She's all of it. And she's like 15. She starts, Thomasina starts at 13, and then in the second act, you, you get to meet her at at 16. She's, she's actually 13, 13 years and 10 months, and then she's 16 years and 11 months and three weeks. <laughs> <laughs>